Hi, welcome back to Bike Forever. So, really excited today. Turned up in the post is a brand new ZX Band for the ZX81. So, these are as rare as hen's teeth, but um, I did manage to get one from someone off Sell My Retro. Uh, and what this is, it's uh, basically a, a massive kind of upgrade where you get a joystick interface inside there you get 32k ram reset button which is i believe down the bottom there and sd card reader and also down the bottom that's uh i believe is the uh, audio output so it supports uh, audio now obviously if you've got a game written to support it uh, so yeah, well chuffed with this, really pleased. Uh, also, a few weeks ago I got a, a new keyboard membrane, which is actually one with uh, micro switches in it, so you can hear when you press the keys. Um, it's, that's a massive improvement as well, but the, the main thing is the, um, the uh, ZX Band, that is absolutely awesome. I've just been having a go with it and I'll, I'll hopefully show you the menu and everything. So when you boot up, when you've got this uh, interface plugged in, what you see is a ZX Pan Plus and this uh, Tom T uh, there at the top. Um, you can um, go into various things like if you if you want to display the files on the SD card, you press now it's just the Z key and that that replaces. Uh, what was on that key which was copy with cat and that just lists the, the directories or files on the SD card uh, you can also cat uh, followed by a directory name so if I just go on my games in quotes so that's that list all the files in, in there so you can see these are my uh, games off h.io uh, also, you can put a file, I think you probably saw it there in the root of the directory, which is um, menu.p. So if you have that and you press shift and then reset, the reset button, it brings up uh, that, uh, well, it automatically runs menu.p. So if you've got a, a menu program in there called menu.p, it'll run it and you can just download that. Um, to go to my games, so these are some of my games on feature.io shameless plug there <laughs> so we've got uh, the snake 16k as you can see it just it just loads and runs instantly it's just this is just like amazing we've had this for a while on zx spectrum uh, the div mmc which is really good and i think this has been around for a while as well but like i say getting hold of one um, it's quite difficult. Um, so now just show this this working now. Oh, this is the original version, I think, without the. Oh no. Um, yeah, this I had changed the keys on this at this point. So it's uh, Q Q A up down and then O P uh, left right. So it's a bit easier to use. Yeah, pretty pretty pleased with this. As I say, it only turned up today. Um, yeah, I'll try. What I'll try and do is get some other games which use the sound output from this as well, and maybe even try writing some new games or Im improving some of my existing games to use sound as well. Okay, um, that's about it for this video. Thanks for watching and. Bye for now.